Hello everyone, welcome to Rima Says and today Rima Says we are going to bake a banana cake. So let's take a look at what are some of the ingredients we need to bake the cake. So first we have this super sponge cake mix and this is bought from this very popular bakery store whereby they sell a lot of bakery products to bake stuff so um, this is a super sponge cake mix so it's a ready-made one so i don't have to add plain flour or baking soda so i'm actually going in and playing cheat and over here i have this um, glass jar and we have white sugar and i'm also using this raw sugar cubes it's brown sugar and over here i have cinnamon powder as well as vanilla coloring vanilla flavor sorry and i have two eggs i have this golden churn creamery it's a golden butter and i'll be using half of it and over here i have milk so the most important ingredient of all is uh, bananas so over here i have about six to seven peeled bananas so these bananas have a red color outer covering so um, i just peeled and put them into this mixing bowl so this one is to mix the wet ingredients and over here is to mix the dry ingredients so once i'm done mixing the wet ingredients i'm going to transfer the dry ingredients with the wet ingredients and i'm going to combine and mix them all together to form the cake batter all right so let's get started for let me move the spatula away so let me start with the dry ingredients since that's the most basic one so i'm going to add about a cup of this cake mixture so please next i'm going to add some cinnamon powder to we are going to add about I'm just going to eyeball it, so probably about a teaspoon of it. And to this, I'm also going to add some white sugar because the cake mixture already has sugar in it, so I'm not going to add a lot of sugar. And so I might add maybe about say three teaspoons full of white sugar and I'll tell you later um, what else we can use the brown sugar for and I'm just going to add about one cube of brown sugar and I'm just going to crush it like that it's a little bit hard so I'm just going to crush it and you know make sure it becomes like a coarse grained powder like this and we're just going to mix it together give it a good mix okay okay so once we have set aside our dry mixture i'm going to go ahead and continue with the wet mixture so for this first i'm going to add two eggs we're going to add some vanilla extract maybe about a teaspoon full or so and to this i'm going to add also about a teaspoonful of milk mm, sorry not teaspoon maybe there's more maybe a tablespoonful of milk as well as this is not melted butter, but it's softened butter. So it's about half of the bar of butter. And this is salted. Okay, it's salted softened butter. So since it has salt inside already, I'm not going to add salt to this. So I've mixed everything together nicely. And this is our cake batter. Look, it has a dropping consistency like this. So I'm going to transfer this into this grease pan. It's it with butter and some white sugar and... So the cake batter is done and we're going to put this in the oven and bake it 
at 180 degrees Celsius for 40 minutes and we shall see how the cake turns out later. So this is the finished banana cake and let me cut and show you what it looks like. Okay, so I've cut the cake and as you can see, it's soft and fluffy on the inside.